Hey guys, JC here at Jackrabbit Off-Road in Huntsville, Texas. We're here checking out the Can-Am Outlander 1000R XMR and how that compares to the Renegade 1000R XMR. Let's so check it out. So from obvious appearance, we can see that the, uh, the Renegade 1000R XMR looks to be a bit sportier and much more aggressive in the design than that of the Outlander. So as we start up here up front, we do have front protection and a much taller snorkel on the front of the machine. We get over here to the Outlander, more of a full-size brush guard, relocated radiator, snorkels are up above the radiator, but just below the handlebars. Whereas on our Renegade, you can kind of see there Definitely up above the handlebars a little bit here. Coming around the back, we got some storage here. Small rear bumper. But on the uh, Outlander, compatible with the Link system, I have a ton of storage options. Some dry storage in the back as well. Even comes with a uh, another bit of dry storage right behind the seat. And this is another link compatible accessory. It does have the uh, cleated metal foot pegs. Make sure you hold on in a deep mud hole. Both of these are at the same horsepower, running the same 1000 R. But you can see the differences are pretty much in the overall size, chassis, and what they're really geared toward. Renegade much sportier machine You're not gonna haul as much gear not gonna fit a cooler on there yeah. this one you can both awesome mud machines running the 30 inch ITPs same over here 30 inch ITPs see these have a uh, beadlock wheel versus the uh, stock aluminum wheels on the uh, Outlander. But uh, yeah, check it out. Again, we're here at Jackrabbit Off-Road in Huntsville, Texas, so come check out these two mud machines as we're warming up here and ready to go riding. Thanks.